Philips Bright underscore 400, did you know that this streamer has purchased $50,000 worth of art and management services? Good choice. Happy to welcome you to our community garden and hope that you'll settle in well. As you might have heard, this is a difficult time for us. Robin, who organized and cared for the community garden, was sadly taken from us too soon. We want to honor their memory. That's why we're looking for someone new to take the reins and bring some life back to this community garden. Everyone is super excited to meet you. Anyway, this is the address for the garden. I'll meet you there to get you up and running. I don't want to get ahead of myself, but I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what you do. Thanks, Jasmine. I'm Jasmine. It's so great to finally meet you. Thanks a bunch for stepping up and volunteering. This garden really means a lot to us. Feel free to have a look around. The garden's not going anywhere. Square. Yeah, yes, it's not very good. Um, change the resolution. Changing it to fourteen forty. cut out for you. I wanted to come by myself, but I've just been so busy. But now you're here, and you can look after the garden properly, and I reckon you're going to do great. Uh, this is, uh... The best starting point is probably the weeds. You can rip them straight out of the ground. You should buy a sickle. Makes it much faster. 
A few weeds in the garden might keep pests away from your plants, but too many, and all they'll do is steal water. It's a fine balance. Always something to keep you on your toes. Where do you dump them now? Leaf pile. Compost bin is a great way to make weeds, leaf piles, and plant cuttings more useful. Leave them in here long enough and they'll turn into compost you can feed to your plants. That'll make the plants grow faster, which basically means a quick way to a prettier garden. to get rid of all the dead plants. It's a shame none of the plants made it, but their seeds should still be salvageable. They're great for just throwing anything and everything inside. so far. I think there's enough room to start planting now. Seeds need a little bit of room to be able to grow properly, some more than others. Otherwise, you can plant them anywhere. I've left Robin's plant book in the shed, too. If you're ever unsure what a plant needs, you can probably find it there.
Um, what is that? N no flies? Striking flowering plant known for its large trumpet shaped blooms of vibrant colors. The amaryllis is a hardy plant that can be grown in many temperate climates. Their stem are hollow, so you can hang them upside down and fill the stems with water. The plant will last for over three weeks like this and continue to flower. Place of magic at garden stall. Soda garden ho hose. Have a bridge rebuilt. Have the rubble cleaned away. Open up the greenhouse. Complete the plant book. Help Jasmine with the pavilion. Okay. That's funny. Open the inventory. Bills. Amazing! So here is your watering can. It's a little small, but it'll work for now. Every seed you plant will need some water to get it going, then need watering regularly. Underwater plants will be brown, crispy, and they'll droop a bit too, and the ground around them will be discolored. Hey, we need to... Oh, I see. Are you serious? I think that's enough for one day. There's no rush with any of this. You should have time to explore anyway. Just keep an eye on the time. Make sure to get some rest at the end of the day. I think I left home too early. Oh. Oh. 